Yo, what's up guys? Hey man, welcome back to the channel. Yo, before I get into the video, before I get into this topic, um, I want to say, man, to everybody that comes on here and clicks on here, thank you so much for coming on the channel, man. Thank you for watching me. Thank you for supporting me. And as you can tell, there's a name change. So yes, it went from One Motivates to the X-Ray Zone. Um, I love the One Motivates name because, it, of course, it has my name. And as you can tell when I when you comment and I comment back, I like to motivate you guys. You know what I'm saying? Nobody's left behind on here. I want you to reach for the best. You know, I want you to be the best of yourself, you know, and, and not, you know, oh, am I too old? Am I not smart enough? Am I, you know, whatever the case may be, man. Look at, look at that poster right there, man. I, I purposely picked that poster for you guys out there, man, because trust me, if you have dedication, motivation, and consistency, you can grab and reach that star, man. Trust me, man. If y'all already know how I roll, y'all already know how I feel about all of y'all, y'all already know when I comment, man, it's sincere. And I love you guys, man. Y'all have been amazing to me. And uh, without you guys, our channel, our channel, I say our channel because y'all help me. But my channel wouldn't be at 6K subscribers without you guys, you know? And y'all know that I keep it 100, you know what I'm saying? So again, it went from one motivates to the X-ray zone. I'm happy about it. And uh, we're gonna have some fun on this channel as we always do. Um, and I am gonna try to start going live a little bit more, um, especially on here. Yes, on my TikTok. I know I always tell you guys to follow it. A lot of people don't listen. Not that they don't listen, but a lot of people don't really go follow me on TikTok. And that's why I haven't went live really because I don't have that many followers. So I feel like I'm just gonna talk to myself when I go live. But I am gonna go live. I haven't. I don't know the dates yet or the days. Um, but it's gonna be at least two days a week. I'm gonna go live with you guys and answer questions. Every day will be a different topic. So we'll stay on that topic and uh, we'll we'll just get cracking. You know what I'm saying? And have fun with it. Um, but yeah, man. So hey, today's video is about why do X-ray technologists have more than one job, right? Everybody's like, why is everybody always working, blah, blah, you know? And trust me, and I mean, it doesn't, it, not all technologists always have two jobs, but I'm gonna say 90% have two jobs and I'm gonna tell you why, okay? So number one, yes, primary. Everybody has that primary full-time job. That's your primary job. And the reason people have primary jobs is to build, you know, seniority for one, to have a full-time status, which means benefits, you know, um, sick time, PTO time, um, you know, cause we don't know what's gonna happen in the future. So you want your medical benefits, you know, you wanna have PTO because we all, we get sick, you know, things happen, we need some days off and you still need to get paid. So everybody has that primary job, right? So you need that primary job to, you know, have all those things rolling. Then number two, you have this, PRN. That's the second reason PRN. The cool thing about PRN, right, is the your primary job, say, for example, you work Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, 312s, you're done. You know, then you off Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. Your, pri your PRN job, you can pick up, be like, you know what, I just wanna work Fridays. And boom, that's it, you work Fridays, you're a PRN. You know, and you know, the good thing about PRN is that you always, companies love PRNs because of the fact that they don't have to pay them benefits they don't owe the PRNs nothing, and they could cut PRNs at any time. At any time, they'd be like, you know what? We don't need you, you know, we're gonna bring our full times more hours or whatever the case may be. So a PRN job is not guaranteed hours, but it's cool to have because you're always gonna need a tech. Sorry, but you are. So it's nice to have that PRN position, you know? And uh, sometimes your primary job, you know, during slow seasons, they send you home, you use your PTO time, so you're like, man, I don't wanna go home, but if I gotta go home, you know, and I can't make no money here, I can't have no overtime here, let me go pick up, you know, uh, some hours in my PRN job, you know what I mean? And you can have more than one PRN job, because one, one PRN job you can work Thursday, the other PRN job you can work Friday, so if that PRN job don't give you hours, then the other PRN job gives you hours, you know? So it's all about money making. That's the third reason. Yes, man, you gotta make money. Especially nowadays, man, you know, with inflation, everything costing so much money, you know, a lot of people can't survive off just one job. You need to, sometimes even three, you know, um, because life is so hard. And even people in the medical field, everybody's like, oh, you work in the medical field, you make a lot of money. <laughs> don't get me wrong, we're blessed. We make decent money, but we don't make, you know, life-changing money. 
we make enough money to to live comfortably you know take care of our family live in a nice neighborhood drive a decent car you know but it's not doctor money you're not making two or three hundred thousand dollars a year unless you're a traveler and even at that it's kind of hard to make that you know um but yeah so that's why people and that's why technologists have more than one job and the cool thing about it is that sometimes at your primary job you're so busy, like say you get an x-ray, an x-ray, just general x-ray job, but you know, you, you want to be like, you know what? I want to learn CT, but the primary job is so busy that they're, they don't have the time to cross train you. That's when the PRN job position opens up. You'd be like, look, man, I'm PRN. I know how to do x-rays already, but I really want to learn CT. 99% of the time, they'll train you how to be a CT tech because CT techs are always needed. So you can use your PRN jobs to pick up a different modality and get certified in something else. So yeah, there's always a reason that you always have two jobs and um, you know, that that's why. You know, I hope guys that this video helped one of y'all out there answer the questions. And um, yeah, man, so hey, as always guys, thanks for watching, thanks for supporting, you already know.